Hello, this is Movit Foot, your friendly media manager from Gaming House and Code UK. Movit Media. I know that lovely stuff. Trying out the microphone and game settings on the new Hoppage HCP VR. Hope you can hear me. Ooh, this has had an update. Ooh. So we're just going to play a little bit of Pac Man just while I'm trying to figure out the settings on this thing. Uh, quite easy to use, but obviously I'm trying to be a power user and get it all. Uh, ooh, uh, I cannot do it without that's better. Let's use a D pad that might be easier. So, this is quite a good little update. It's not Pac Man in the way that you'd normally imagine Pac Man, really. Um, it's almost linear. In the way it encourages you to get chased by ghosts, etc. You definitely need the. Uh, I've got the chrome uh, joypad with the twisty D pad thing. And it looks immensely because the thumbsticks do not work. On an old school game like this, at least in my humble opinion. a bit too big for their boots, those ghosts. Ooh, go away. I've balls this up now. Completely going in the wrong direction. Try and uh, get this back. Right. Ah. Yeah, completely stuff this up. So what was I saying? Um, yeah. Let's come back from the uh, expo. Very good it was too, well it always is really, but not biased. But it's not just about the retro, you know, it's um, it's, it's not the retro, I mean we've had a, there's a lot of new stuff there this uh, this year. As there always is. The GDs seem to enjoy it, those are completely cool. Been a bit too fast for me. And uh, yeah, a lot of people looking for the PlayStation 4s and stuff, but you know, where am I going there? So, to be honest though, I wasn't that impressed with the, with the PS4s. You got Assassin's Creed and everything, and you know, Assassin's Creed is a. Assassin's Creed is a very good uh, game and all that, but it wasn't. Ah, I'm dead. Yeah, it wasn't um, graphically that much different to the original in my humble opinion. Remember the when I went when I was younger I went from a spectrum straight into a mega drive. Obviously there was a big jump there. It's like my brother thought was saying it's big to visit them. Has have game has game game in terms of graphically got as good as it's gonna be. I'd like to think that, uh, that there is a way to go, and obviously developers and things have got to learn new systems and how to use them and things. But, uh, hang on. There we are. Obviously, the de while developers learn these new systems and how they what makes them tick, and. Oh, the D pad's gone, I'll skew with the. You know, what makes them tick, what makes them do what they need to do. 
that you, you know, things are going to be so I mean, the concept is a new system, so there's that, and then, and then you, you get games like this, where it's all about the gameplay, and, uh, I'm assuming you just play with this. It's, um, uh, I know it's a pleasant reference. There you go. Not a brilliant score, but not a bad one either. I know it's a personal preference thing, um, but I'm still not decided. Yeah, I'm still not decided. Um, it sparks for one second. Not decided, where, you know, where we're going to go, what we're going to do with the new next gen. I mean, I've got a lot of tech here already that I'm playing with a lot, so it's like, where'd you find the time? I don't know. Let me know in the comments below, and obviously let me know your score. You probably whoop my ass. And until then, you can follow me on Twitter at Mubit, and I am at Mubit on YouTube, and I also run Retrocast UK and Gaming Ads UK. Hope you enjoyed that. See you in the next show. Ta-ra!